morning to uh, all distinguished guests at the Corgi. But all that has been said so far has yet to sink in. But what I can say so far from what, uh, from my experience and my association with Fosfal over many years, I've been associated with Fosfal and especially with the G or G for many years. And though we're celebrating the 63rd festival, I have not been to all of this, but I've been to quite a few. And uh, it has always been my privilege to be part of, of Fosfal. And um, what we have heard as the first speaker from Ajit Kaur, she shared with us her trials, tribulations, and her triumphs in bringing us to where it is. And today I think we are here to celebrate her biggest triumph, to bring us all together with all the problems and um, obstacles that she experienced. So I think we have to really uh, be grateful and as, uh, as we believe in destiny, this was our destiny to come together here in this gallery and thanks to Akhanaji and uh, Ajit we are here through, through all that they come through we have to appreciate and each one of us has been looked after so well giving us such a wonderful place to stay Thank you so much. And um, to the uh, guest of honor, your speech was really, um, you know, it's something that we all need today to look at what is important. And uh, talking about women and children, malnutrition, children's education, women's education. And I think these are things that we read about in the headlines and newspapers and think about it in forums like this, but we forget. And I think this is a responsibility that we all have to take seriously and not just say, oh, this happened somewhere else. And I think we have all to make an effort. And I, I'm very, uh, well, I don't know if it's the right forum. I believe one of our biggest beliefs is the children of our country. And uh, I have on my own, started um, ECCD, but uh, in Bhutan, of course, we do not have the abject poverty where children have absolutely no access, but I live in a small community where distances to the government ECCDs are, so I have started a small one. I'm a great believer in children's education, so in the last few years, I have concentrated mostly for writing for children with illustrations that is culturally context. So I write about Bhutanese uh, environment, Bhutanese folklore, Bhutanese story, so that children can identify with when they're growing up and they're not jumping at Puss in the Boots or Cinderella somewhere far away. So, so this, is, this is what I've been doing. And a part of my growth, much of my growth, has come through interactions like this as a writer. And this, for this, I would like to thank a hundred million times the GG. Thank you for the exposure, for the opportunity that you gave me. And I hope, uh, you know, all the wisdoms, all the gems that we have uh, uh, been given today, that we can all take back to our communities, to our families, to our, our own children and just not let them rest there, but let them activate all this. Thank you so much. And it's a great, great pleasure to be here and a privilege. Thank you.